It's as massive as the Pacific Ocean, so I'm sure he's got anything, and he's going to go for Malphite again. Why not? Go to bring it back here. Malphite. I think very similar to game number one. Um, Lissandra ain't killing Malphite. So no. if Sandbox don't snowball, game becomes very hard to play out for them. But I do think that... King can just... Just clap. And hey, the knock up the ignite as well, but Lantern Shield comes in as cuz. Level four, and Envy took a massive chunk now as he does have Flash. Has popped the ghost already. Cuz looking to burn some summoners here. I, I don't the know. UK. Yeah, man, they're probably. Okay. Do. There's the Flash. Yeah, should be fine now. Yeah. Hens just gonna hop over to his AD carry. Uh -oh. We do have the root coming in, but Hens with Merc Turrets. Yeah, they, they gotta slow it down. Okay, Malphite under the turrets, going to ult away. That's big. Because of his cooldown, now got the guild force as well. As uh oh, Cuz uh -oh. going very deep beyond a ward as he's just gonna Crescent Guard, but he gets stunned up anyway as First Blood yeah, should be able to get down on key. Right, because Envy has to play very respectful. The rest doesn't have a great setup as, yeah. Um, it must have been a misread here on, on where they were and uh, them backing after the Herald because, yeah, they're it's Vi and Lasson. Okay, um, never mind. Just, just yeah. Just. Uh, the, the insane amount of dive with Vi and Lissandra and Cassante. Knock back here. Yeah. Birdall's like, okay, I'm gonna knock him into the Vi. Yeah, a little action here. Nope. <laughs> hey, he took the claw. I'll give him that. He took the claw. They have started it up now, and they're back off. All right, I think this is the moment. Hook into Keen as Closer is behind enemy lines, but they just try to turn onto him as deep he goes. He gets charmed as in goes Lahenz. A massive combo in the back line. Envy can't play the game as he's kiting back, though. Keen is super tanky, but he will eventually go down. Has to try to flash to get away from this one. And a massive right. red visual comes in. Aiming goes in just to die immediately as KT runs straight into Liv Sandbox's trap. Man, they shouldn't have pressed their buttons. <laughs> it was a Sandbox, mistake! They win the fight and they're gonna take down the bear. Oh dear, exactly what we were worried about as the death cap is finished now. Look at Envy here, right? Because Envy and Aiming are the only people that really matter. Closer gets taken low, sure, but as a cell phone, and there is no follow up here. Keen hits his ultimate, but there is no cuz, there's no BDD, there's no aiming. And this, once this happens, and Envy just gets to kite back like and that. This, with a oh, the hook from Kyle. Yeah, Kyle's uh, <laughs> um, the exhaust as well. He right? is a genius mastermind. Which I think the, the Nalar. Doesn't mean this game is entirely over, but we do see Keen. Um, He's checking into them as he is incredibly tanky, of course. He can kind of sustain the damage. Beats out the closer ult, yeah, that's, I guess. That's two ultimates. That's big. Willer also ulted him. Um, without Envy actually in position with white guns, like he still needs time. Yeah, now BDD's making his way in. We got teleport back in from Keen. They don't care about the Drake. Uh, I mean, Cuz might get in to try to steal it, but he doesn't really matter. Oh, he gets in and he does steal it! It's actually huge from Cuz to pick this one up. They get the Chemtex, so they're looking for the follow-up fight as a massive Keen ultimate gets on top of Envy and the charm is there! Aphelios does zero damage in the fight, and KT finally find the angle. The mental game is gone as they press their buttons. Might be looking at a, uh, a flip for Elder here. Uh, Velda says, uh... Watch Keen's angle, how he uh, gets in. Yeah, so, so Cuz getting this is one thing, right? But that's surmountable. But then this yeah. play from Cuz? From Keen? Uh, from Keen. Man, <laughs> I, I swear I'm watching the game, Velda. Uh, Cuz getting the steal, though, yeah. kind of sets off, I think, the panic sensors for Sandbox. Yeah. And then they seem very scattered, very disjointed. And uh, yeah, the moment that the is map right now. Cause and Lahans on an angle. Nice little angle here. Kyle in a little bit of trouble as Cuz is not the target you want to attack here. <laughs> really, as MB is autoing onto him, but the Crescent Guard is there. Hook comes in. They're Dang. going pretty deep onto this one. As oh man, the Moonlight Visual misses. 
and zero damage will be done on that, that one as now they're trying to get in onto Closer as a nice little W here, but Closer is just going to have to ult himself. Trying to click the Lantern, but he cannot. He will go down. And it's already taken, you know, 3k damage-ish. Well, it's a, it, it is a lot of damage, though, because KT has four dragons. Charm in onto Vertal. As Cuz in a little bit of trouble here, but he is followed up. Nice stopwatch for Willer, but will he survive from here as he goes in onto Vertal, trying to make a play here onto the Cassante, who is just draining in life, goes in the, into the zone plane, and a massive Keen ultimate again! MV is just on the run, but down he goes! But they lose the Aphelios, and that should be the nail in the coffin. They finally get the fight they were looking for, and KT will be able to take down the series 3-1. to one. It was a rough and bumpy ride, Valdas. And KT coming in like the clear favorite in the end. Clean 3-1. Nothing, Nothing to, see to see here. here. Oh, what what pristine dominance from KT tonight. <laughs> oh man, jokes aside, they get the job done. That's what matters. You get the win. You, you move on to double elimination where you will at least have the buffer. And that they do. They take down Live Sandbox 3-1. but I think consistently he was finding these good ults. Media, I mean, it's all right. He, he had a good game. Right, I mean, like the, the Aria working out for him, hit a couple of great skills, also built damage, which I personally yeah. am very happy about. Imagine that. Yeah, I know, right? Uh, I want to hear these comms. Look at Kane again. Oh, they're on. They have full vision, right? Ward's just sitting there. Oh. They're like mid, no bot, no mid, no bot. As uh, you know, they're just on the KT roster coaster. What, what can you expect? But, but you see, I, I'm sure we'll get a little bit of Lahan shouting. But they're not, they're not feeling amazing. And um, lots to learn, but what matters is they got the victory. Yeah, maybe this is uh, a first step, a uh, educational step, perhaps for the team. <laughs> when La Hens is